What's going on everybody? My name is Sheens, bringing you guys more ranked double battles for Pokemon Sword and Shield. In today's video, we are rocking out with this Dusk Ops Trick Room team with my boy Pex on it, so I'm hyped for it because everybody loves the Toxic spec. But we are here in Season 3, ready to push Master Ball tier once again. So if you guys are excited for this video or you just want to support the channel, make sure you smash that like button for me and click that big red subscribe button so you know when my videos go live. Also guys, I was checking my analytics and about 80% of the viewers here are not subscribed to the channel like what are you guys doing i'm already in your feed make it easy for you by clicking that subscribe button here we go with this team dust clops is going to be the main point you guys already know the room or the rules for this team like we're going to be trying to set up this trick room and if we cannot get the trick room like after looking at that guy's team we have this hexers who is fast arcanine who is fast we go in for fable for the follow me's and all that have that snorlax in the back or the pecs we don't even have to run trick room but this is just looks like a solid team you guys like to use it for yourself run the code is at the bottom on the screen try it out let me know how you guys do with it in season three also let me know for question of the day what are you guys hoping for for season three like for me, I'm hoping that like the meta changes, like something different comes through. Like I'm tired of all this trick room teams, the sleep teams and all that. I'm hoping just like something changes. So let's get rolling here. Let's get rolling. There are my rental teams. We're going to pop out here into rank battles. I went eight and six. I think I'm eight and seven now because I tried a rank battle with this team just to learn it up a little bit. Yes, we are eight and seven with this team. Pretty close to Master Ball tier. We might get it today. We might not. We'll see. We'll see. But we're going to hop into this battle. I went eight and six on my stream. Probably should have went eight and four with that Toga Tomorrow team. If you haven't checked out the Toga Tomorrow team. Go to, it's a couple videos ago, but go check it out. It is an awesome team. One of my favorite teams right now. Definitely one of my favorite teams right now. So if you haven't checked that out, go over there, check it out. But if you want to catch me live on Twitch, Jeans25, link is in the description. Come hang out. We stream four plus days every single week. Always going live, always having fun, doing viewer battles over there too. But here we go. Like I said, we went eight and six in our first stream in season three. But I think we should have went like eight and four, maybe eight and three, considering... I made a few bad plays. I made a few bad plays. Considering I took like four days off from playing because I was out of town. But still, we made a few bad plays where I should have took out like another Pokemon that would have won us the game. Instead of the other one. But we're chilling. But here we go. Here we go. Finally, first match for this video. This guy. We can roll the Trick Room squad here. We can roll with the Trick Room squad here. We're going to go into the Claps and the Fable. He's probably going to go into the Snarl. I could totally see him rolling Snarl right off the rip. Who else can I see him roll? Maybe that Inky Slash. I could totally see him rolling that Inky Slash. Um, I'm gonna bring the Pex and and the Hexress in the back. Where do I bring the Lax? Where do I bring the Lax? I kind of want this Pex in here. Pex is just so good. I love Toxic Pex. <laughs> Especially he's a defense tank, and most of these Pokemon look like they're, uh, actually, he has that Rotom, which is kind of scary. Which is kind of scary. Do we get Snorlax instead? I think Pex would be better. I think Pex would be better. He can get some burns off, and he can get some poises off, considering we're rocking Baneful Bunker with him, and we have Stockpile. This is a nice little moveset for doubles with him. Instead of that typical, like, singles moveset where it's just like, oh, I'll just put Toxic on, I'll recover, maybe go into a substitute, protect, game over. I remember I did that to somebody, and, like, it's cool at first, but, like, it gets so boring after a while. Like, okay, cool, I'll set up the Toxic and just wait this one out. <laughs> but here we go. Let's get this win. First battle for this video. Let's get rocking out, guys. Look at that dude's outfit. Mmm, spicy. Let me know if I should change up my outfit, guys. I really kind of want to know. But we're going to go Clops into Fable. We minimize right off the rip. I know I'm setting up the trick room. We're gonna frisk. Okay, a metal herb and a light clay. Obviously, the light herb or the light clay is popping out here. We're gonna go into the trick room here. I mean, he might taunt me. Do we think he's gonna taunt me? I'm gonna roll trick room. I'm gonna say he doesn't taunt me. If he does, then that's fine. And we can just go into a moon blast and roll it over to this, uh. Roll it over to this Grimstar to have him stop setting up screens. The Corbinite might just iron defense up, but that's fine. We have our pecs in the back. Who's going to be special attacker. We can put a burn on him on that Quiver Knight for later or a poison on it. I would love to get a burn on it like right off the rip in a little bit. But we have that Evo Light with this Dust Cops, which is dope. He is going to withdraw the Quiver Knight. That is chilling. That is actually chilling for us. And he's going to go into the Angie Slash? Nope, the Drill comes out here. Not the Drill. Not the Drill. And here comes a Fake Out on who? On my Fable. That's chilling. We're chilling. Okay, we punch. We couldn't move. No Moon Blast. But we do get this Trick Room off. We do get this lovely little Trick Room off here, which is just dandy. We twisted the dimensions. Um, he's probably going to go for a steel move on us. Are we holding a Babiri Berry? That's my question. Are we holding a Babiri Berry? We might be holding a Babiri Berry. Let me see. We know the steel move is coming out here. Like, we know the steel move is coming out here. We are holding a berry. Is that the Babiri? Let me check the summary. Let me check the summary. Real quick. It is the Babiri Berry. Okay, so steel types are not going to do, like, nothing to us. They're still super effective. I can go for a life do. I think we're going to double into the, uh... Hmm. We go for a Nightshade. Hmm to the user level so it's gonna do it's gonna do a little bit of damage <laughs> we go for a nightshade or do we put the burn 
We go for a pain sweat. We're gonna put the burn over on this drill. The drill is kind of scary. The drill is rather scary. And we're gonna throw a moon blast over on you. We are gonna go first. Maybe I should have set up a minimize to try to dodge the attack. Does not go for the Dynamax. That's fine. We have the Babiri Berry, so I think we're gonna eat up just fine. We're gonna start going after these Pokemon. Let's get it. Let's go. Burn on you, little boy. Get over here. We're gonna burn you. We know the Iron Head's popping. Like, we know the Iron Head's popping. Get out of here. Moon Blast coming at you. Yeah, you're not gonna do too, too much because the, uh, the light screen's there. Still does a decent amount. And we're gonna drop stats. We are gonna drop his little special defense stat or special attack, which is fine. Iron Head's gonna pop. And here goes our berry. Here goes our berry. You're not making us flinch here. Let's get it. Look at that. Eating up. We are chilling. We are chilling. A beery berry rocks out here. And we get that burn on him. So we're just gonna start like ticking away here. I might go for the minimize. Oh, honestly. I might go for the minimize. Could go for a nightshade here. Yeah, let's go for a nightshade over on you. I'm gonna go for the minimize. Not even gonna lie here. Where do we take out that thing? I think I go for the minimize and try to start dodging some attacks. That's the plan. That is the plan. Let's get this nightshade rolling. Nightshade, yeah, yeah, baby. Do a little bit of damage. It goes for the user's level, so it's gonna do about that damage each time. But does minimize come up clutch here? You would love to see it. You would love to see it. Gonna raise our stats, baby. Foul play's coming out here. On who? On who? Not the clops. The clops Evo like he eats up perfectly fine. Iron head miss. Oh, minimize, baby. Minimize, baby. Let's get it. <laughs> That's huge. Do we go for another one? Because I think this uh this takes him out here. And I think we go for another one. I think we go for another one. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Minimize coming up clutch. Minimize coming up clutch, dude. I love Fable. I really do love Fable. Show me this night chain takes out. I think it should. Let's see it. Show it. Oh, bruh. Bruh. Come on. How's that night shade not taking him out? I wanna get another I wanna get a life duo. I really do. We're gonna go for another minimize here. That play's gonna pop. Clefable avoids attack. Avoid it, Clefable. Oh no, Iron Head pops. All right, we eat though. So we go for a life do here. Like, they're bound to miss. They're bound to miss very, very soon. We're gonna take out the Grimstar. We're gonna go for a life do. Go Nightshade here on you. Take you out. And we're gonna go for, go for a life do here so we can eat up a, an attack, heal up our Pokemon, and potentially the, the X Drill's gonna miss. Potentially the X Drill is gonna miss. So we're sitting pretty. We're sitting pretty here. What a first start. What a start right here. Hopefully we can pull off this win. I gotta get this drill out the way. That is true. That is true that we have to get the drill out the way. There's no way. Well, he might Dynamax. He might Dynamax. Not even gonna lie. We're gonna get a free Nightshade here. He might Dynamax soon. So I just gotta let that burn kind of tick away here. So we're gonna get a Life Duel off here. And then we're gonna start... Oh, he is Dynamaxing. Jesus, man. He's gonna Dynamax so he does not miss. That is some tough news. That is some tough news. But our Life Duel is gonna go before that. Our Life Duel is gonna go before that. And I'm gonna get my pecs out here. I'm gonna get my pecs out here. Because we are a defensive tank with my pecs. I might Dynamax my pecs and save my extras for the back end. Because my pecs will go first in the trick room. But dude, that's scary. Nightshade's gonna pop here. I'm gonna try to get this burn off on that thing in a little bit. Well, let's go. Can we eat this up? I don't think we're eating this one up. I really don't think we are eating this one up. This is rather scary. This is rather scary. He does go for the Dynamax. That was like his last little hope. <laughs> Imagine if he misses, but you can't miss. Dynamax attacks don't miss. Okay, let's see what he does. Max steals. Like, that was smart by him to go into Dynamax. Probably take out my Fable here. Fable, eat, buddy. Oh, Fable, I love you. I love you, Fable. Okay, Fable, what are you going to do here? Are we just going to go for a follow me here? Can we go for a follow me and end here and get the burn on that, uh... Can we get the burn on the Corvo? Or do we trick room here? I said we get the burn on the... On that, and we don't set up a trick room just yet. I say we don't set up a trick room just yet. We're gonna go into the follow me here, because the extra drills should go first now, and we should just be able to take up this hit, uh, hit rather than go into my clops. Follow me coming through, dude. Minimize came up big. We're gonna get a burn over on that Corvo. What are you gonna go for here? You're gonna go for a max quake. That's chilling. That's chilling. Drop our special defense, even though you're a uh, physical attacker. Or is it gonna raise your special defense? Is that what it does? It raises their special defense. Okay. Okay. We still have our Dynamax for our Hexers, Maximers. So I gotta see if we outspeed. That is my question. Like, this drill has to go. This drill has to go. And a Roost is gonna pop here. That's totally fine by me. That is 100% fine by me. We're gonna get the burn on the Corviknight, which will come up big later. Which will come up big later. Get a nice little burn action. Do we roll the Trick Room? Do we roll the Trick Room is the question. I think we might have to roll this Trick Room here. I kinda wanna stockpile. Hmm. I know ground moves are super effective to my pecs. I know it's super effective to my pecs. And we could go into a max guard right off the rip. 
We could go into a max garden, or we can die to max you. Do we see him out speed? Let me see the sync stats. Let me see the sync stats. Is it a jolly Hexorus? We are speed. Is it jolly? It's adamant. Hmm. That is actually really tough. Like, do we outspeed? Kind of need to know. Do I go for it? Do I go all out? Let's go all out here. We're going to go after this thing. We're going to Dynamax here and save our Pex for the back end. Because Pex can come up big in the late rounds. Okay, we're going to Dynamax the Hex. I think the Hex. Do we think the Hex is outspeeding this thing? That is some tough news. I can see it eating up a shot, though. I can totally see it eating up a shot. Um, We could go Nightshade. I say we double into this thing. Make sure this thing goes out. We go for the Max Quake here. Come on, Hex. I need you here, Hex. We take those. We take those wins, baby. That is how it's done. This guy quit on me. <laughs> he saw the Hex come out. He's like, well, he's probably out to speed to me. That's game. We take those. Look at that. This dude quit. This dude quit. I kind of want to see. No, we kind of just canceled this out. That's what's up. So we ended up getting that win, which was awesome. We made that dude quit. That is hilarious. That is hilarious. He just saw my Hex. He's like, nah, son, I'm out of here. He said he's out of here. Do we run the trick room here, though? We run the trick room. We could possibly run the trick room here. He's probably going to lead Toad Kissed around on. Like, not even gonna lie. Toad kissed around on it. It's probably gonna pop here. Hmm. Hmm. We're just gonna go follow me into Colossal. Maybe weakness policy Colossal. That is some tough. This is this is looking a little scary for us. This is looking a little scary for us. I mean, he's rocking a lot of special attackers. I might go into my Arcanine. Arcanine Fable here. Could work out fine. Not even. Do we even run the Trick Room here? Do we even run the Trick Room here? Hmm. <laughs> like, I want to, but then I don't want to. <laughs> What's the plan? What is the plan? I could... Do I bring Klops in for the back? I mean, Trick Room's gonna come up so big. It's gonna come up so big. We might as well go into... I said we... I said we go into Klops... Yeah, let's go Klops Fable. Let's go Klops Fable right off the rip. Bring Hexers in the back. Do we go Pex? Or Arcanine? I mean, Arcanine could be big, but Pex is big too. With all these physical attackers. Well, not all of them, but still. Let's go into the pecs here. With the black sludge, I gotta watch out for my water move up against that uh Colossal. I gotta watch out for that water move. I mean, is he running like surf? Trying to trigger weakness policy? Like, I wish I had clear smog or like topsy turvy. That would be awesome. That would be awesome. Now, who's he gonna roll out with? Who is he gonna roll out with? We got that win in the first one, which is dope, which is dope. Kinda scared for this one. Like, I see that the Raladon, that the Raladon is so scary. Like, the Raladon is so good. And it's a beast up against all my Pokemon, just about. Like, the Rowdon has so much coverage and all that. It's just always a good lead. Let's see. No, the Rowdon goes to the Darmani team. The Darmani team to kiss action. We're going to go into the little bit of Collapse and Fable. Um, How are we going to roll out here? We got the Frisk. Okay, we see the Babiri Berry. We're going to roll out into a Trick Room right off the Rippo. Trick Room is probably the best call. And we could go for a Follow Me, or I'm just going to go for a Minimize here. Oh, honestly? Where do we go? Yeah, I'm going to go for a Minimize here. We'll go for a minimize. Hopefully this thing potentially goes for a follow me or something. But or hopefully this thing doesn't dynamax and we can dodge some attacks. So minimize is gonna pop here. Raise our evasiveness. I still crash. He goes first too. Okay, that's that's fine. That's fine by me. He's trying to go to, he's gonna try to make my desk ops flinch. No, he's trying to make my fable flinch, I guess. So yo, Yawn's gonna pop here. Not on my clops. Not on my clops. That is rather scary. Let's get this trick room out though. Minimize pops here. Which is lovely, which is lovely. We try to drop that. Yeah, we're gonna try to drop that uh Things attack. Not attack, it's special attack. I think we're gonna try to drop the Kiss's special attack here. We try to put a burn on something, which could be nice. Pain split. The pain split is nice. The user adds its HP to the target's HP, then equally shares the combined HP with the target. That's, that, is, that is a nice little move. Um, Nightshade, we could go for a Nightshade, we could go for a burn. Hmm, what is the call? Who do we really want to get out the way here? We have a minimize up. I kinda wanna go here. I kinda wanna go for a light dude. I'd say he's missing, but. We will go first. I'm gonna go for a life through and say he misses. I'm gonna go for a life through and say that he is missing. We're gonna put a little bit of burn action on these guys. A little bit of burn, y'all. <laughs> I love Dust Cop, dude. He's so funny. But the thing is, I haven't seen a Dust Snore yet. Life through's gonna pop here. I'm gonna heal up before my Clops goes to sleep. Before my Clops goes to sleep, he's gonna do a little bit of burn action. Nice little bit of health back. Hopefully, this, this, these guys miss. Yawn's coming out here. Yo, knock it off! Like, knock it off. Making me yawn like that. Miss. Miss. No, okay. That's probably going to take out my Fabes. Fabes gone. Stable Iso Crash. Fabes, I love you. I love you to death, Fable. I'm going to get a burn off here. Do we go for a burn? No. My Clops is going to sleep. Night, night, Clops. Um, how do we roll out from here? How do we roll out from here? Uh, 
I mean, I guess we'll just throw a little Will-O-Wisp on the side over here. And then I think we just throw a nice little Moon Blast over here. We're probably going to roll into, not our Haxorus. Not going to roll out into our Haxorus. Let's cop this Snoring. He has to yawn. That is scary. That is scary. Moon Blast is going to pop here. Can we drop your special attack before we do go out here? And hopefully you guys both miss. That will be just lovely. There goes your special attack drop. Wonderful. That's some Gleam. The Fable Voids. That's awesome. Thank you, Minimize. Clops eats it up. Gets a crit? What you mean? And then crit on me. Ice Cream Crash. Ooh wee. Ooh wee, baby. Okay, we're going to go to sleep here. We're going to try to put a burn on that, uh, on the Darmanitan. And we're just going to try to life do from here. No, no, no. Why did I do that? No. You're going to burn's going over on the Darmanitan. And we're just going to try to go for a life do here while we can. Nice little Minimize coming up big. Minimize is coming up big. They're going to roll out from here. That's cops. Look at this one eye. It's just sleeping. <laughs> <laughs> the one I was just napping. He's gonna withdraw the Darmanitan. He rolling into from here. Probably gonna try to set up with someone. Oh, ooh, oh! Scary to route on. Yes, we wake up and we do get the burn on him. Just, just dandy. Just, just dandy. Oh, ye baby, give me that burn. Probably gonna put me to sleep once again. That's what I think is gonna happen. We get the burn. The Fable is still napping. Hmm. That's some games gonna pop. Fable, dodge it. Yes, Fable. Um, we can go for a pain split here. We go for a pain split. Over on that Duraldon, get some HP back. We'll go for a Pain Split. Just drop it down a little bit. I think Pain Split would be the best bet. Pain Split over on the Duraldon. And then, um. We go for the Life Do again? I said we do go for the Life Do again. I said we do go for the Life Do again. Try to heal up that Dust Cops. We know Dust Cops will go first. This is lovely. He is gonna Dynamax. He's Dynamaxing the boy here. Probably going for a Max Darkness. That is rather scary. But the Trick Room's gonna end soon, and then we have the Hexorus Maximus over here. We're just chilling. Hopefully, we can dodge the Dazzle Gleam once again. Because he, I know he's coming Max Darkness probably to my Desktops, and then sliding over with the Dazzle Gleam or something from there. But geez, you got some mean HP. Got some mean HP now. Pain Split's coming out here. Give me some of that. Take you down a little bit. That will probably do the most work for us, would be that Pain Split. But Fable does wake up here. We're gonna go for a Life Dew here. Nice little Life Dew. Heal up just, just a tad bit. Just a tad bit. Gonna be nice. Oh, uh, you baby, give me some of that hell. Yes, sir, Clefable. Yes, sir. This cop's gonna go back up to full. And here comes the darkness, I'm thinking. The yawn's gonna pop. Over on my collapsy poo. Not the collapse. He's going for a steel spike. That's the question. Steel spike's gonna pop. And our Babiri Berry comes out. Can we eat with the Babiri Berry? That would be awesome. That would be awesome. Just start wasting these turns out. Eat it. Oh, my God. I feel like it was so close. I wish you would tell us how much damage it exactly did. He's going to raise his defense stat. We still have the Trick Room out here, so we are going to roll out with our boy. Right? We still have, like, one more turn of Trick Room, I believe. So we might as well roll out with our boy. Our boy, Pex. We have the burn on you, and we have the burn on you. Okay. We have our Hexers in the back. Okay, so no Trick Room. No Trick Room. Do we, do we roll this? This is this is a scary call. I want to roll that, but then I don't want to roll that. Ba -ba 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 hmm. Scary. This is scary, guys. Hmm. We're gonna go into the pack. Save our hacks for the back. I'm gonna roll another trick room here. Do I roll another trick room? Is that the goal? Yeah, I'm gonna roll another trick room here. Pack's gonna come in here. I think we stockpile here. Trick room. Could recover. Recover would probably be the best buy. Or we can go for a baneful bunker. Just to protect. Just to protect. And get the trick room rolling. Just to protect and get the trick room rolling. Baneful bunker is gonna pop here. It's not even gonna poison. We're just doing it so we can soak up some hits. That, that's the plan. That's the plan. Just so we can soak up some hits. This thing's probably going for max lightning. Not even gonna lie. But I just want this trick room up. Here goes a darkness. A little bit of darkness into my Clops action. Let me eat. Clops. Oh, you're the best, Clops. I love you. I love you, Clops. Okay. Go ahead. Drop my health down. I would love to see. Our special defense is gonna fall. That is rough. That is gonna do some work on my boy. Dawn's gonna pop here. Lovely protect. Lovely protect comes out here. And we're gonna be able to get up with this trick room. I think we double into that kiss here. I seriously think we double into that kiss. Make sure that thing goes out. I said we make sure that kiss goes out. We can go into a scald and a uh that thing there's no way it has to protect. Oh man! Those cops went to sleep. Went to sleep. Um I said we just go for a pain split. I said we just go for a pain split. We're gonna play this one rather slow. Rather slow. And we're just gonna go into a nice little uh scald over on you. Because I know the yawns coming out here. This is just terrible. Yawns are terrible. Helping hand. Oh no! You're taking out my clops here, buddy. Bye-bye, clops. Clops, it was nice knowing you, man. Man, dude, Skull's gonna pop here. Yeah, yeah. Get him. 
do, do some more damage. Let me see. So we get the burns. Max Lightning. Oh, you're going. Oh, you're taking out you. A little biscuit. Okay, Bipex. Bipex, dude. Duraludon's so good. He's just so good. It's so tough. It's just so tough, honestly. It's so tough with the Duraludon. Just, just everybody rocks him, and he just counters everything so hard. Okay, now the, now the thing is, do we outspeed the what's called? Do we outspeed that Duraludon in Trick Room? That's tough, because Hex is kind of fast. I'm hoping we are slower now. <laughs> we do have the Trick Room up. We do have the Trick Room up. We are adamant. We are not a jolly little Hexers. We learned that. We learned that in the last match. We break the mold. Okay, and he goes down. We have the Dynamax. I, like, I want to say we go for the what's it called? I want to say we go for the guard. We cannot even guard. That is so tough. Like, I want to say we take out that Togekiss. Cause, oh, dude, because that Togekiss is going to go for a yawn. We're just going to max Quake into this. And then we're going to say Klops wakes up. Wake up, Klops. Klops, I need you here, buddy. We go for the Nightshade. We get this Quake off. We could be in this game. We could be in this game. It's really coming down to this. Maybe I shouldn't have set up that Trick Room. Maybe I shouldn't have. We'll see if it pays off in the end. Let's see. Let's see. Like, we still have my cops. We still have Pain Split. Pain Split can come up huge. It can totally come up huge. Come on, boys. Let's see what we got. Wake up, buddy. Follow me. He's going to pop here. Oh, my lord. I should have saw that coming. That just wasted my turn. That just wasted my turn. And that's going to take me out anyway. So we oh, no. It does not. So we are faster. That's rough news. That is rough news. Max Quake pops. Oh, my lord. Do I say Klops wakes up here? This is this is terrible. <laughs> okay, so no, my Hexer should still be alive. Do I say Klops wakes up here? Like Klops, I need you to wake up here. Like this is my last ditch effort. I need Klops to wake up, take you out, and we need to go for a max quake over on you. Like that's the plan. Even though we know the follow me is coming out again. Dust Klops wakes up. Beautiful. Nightshade pops. Should be able to take out this. Kiss. Take him out. Okay, Kiss is gone. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Man, he did a good little follow me there. I wasn't really expecting that. I was expecting a yawn. Draco Meteor comes out here. We should be able to eat. We do eat. We do eat here. He's gonna drop his stats. We still have my Clops here. Here goes a little Quake action. This should be able to take him out here. Nice little super effective. He's down Dynamax. This should be bye bye to him. Not even close. That's rough news. Okay. Burn's gonna pop. Nightshade should be able to take it out. We're gonna boost our special defense. Oh my lord. Here we go. Coming down to the wire. Burn comes here. Nightshade should be able to take him out. And we should go first because of the Trick Room. Coming down, guys. It's coming down to the wire. Hmm. I'm trying to think. If we would have... Nah, we're fine. Well, if we would have attacked... No, no. Nothing would happen. It wouldn't have changed anything. Let's go. Alright. Here goes the pole. The pole. Okay. Nightshade needs to take him out here. Nightshade needs to take you out here. And we go into a warm one. Hold the phone, people. Because the, the Dragon Pole should be faster than my Hatchers. Unless it's not running speedy. Yet. Dragon Pole here. Cause we're in the trick room. We are in the trick room. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. Clops, take him out here. Clops, take him out here. Come on, Clopsy. Come on, Clops. Yes! Clops comes up big. Come on, Haxers. I need you here, baby. Go ahead, Hax. Go ahead, Hax. Show me this thing's not Sash. Show me this thing's not Sash. Oh! No! No! No, please! Show me this thing misses. Show me this thing misses. This is coming down. This is coming down the wire here. We are going to drop his attack, which is huge. Show me this thing misses. Dragon Claw is not going to miss. I'm going to take out my hacks. Oh, my lord. Okay. Okay, I'm not scared. Nightshades, we are still in the Trick Room. I think we have one more turn in the Trick Room, so Nightshade should come out here first. There's no there's no way this thing's rock. Oh, no. No, please. This is scary. Who's his last Pokemon? If that thing wasn't Sash. Comes out to the darn Manitan. We aren't Evo like it. We could go for the Pain Split. I have to take out you. Do I go for the trick room? Hmm. Hmm. We're gonna take out the cops here. Hopefully that Darmantan misses his icicle crash. No, he does not. That's probably gonna make me flinch anyway. I don't think it takes us out. We need we need Dragon Bolt to miss. Dragon Bolt miss! Just for a fan of force, you little biscuit. Pain Split would have been the call. That's game. GG. GG. Pain Split would have been the call. Man!
Man, dude, what a match. That was actually a very good match. Came down to the wire. Came down to the wire. We're going to go for a paint split. Hopefully, he misses. Double miss. That's our only hope here. Jeez, nice Phantom Force here. We should have went for a paint split right off the rip to the Thermantan. That would have been tight nice. That could have potentially... No, but Phantom Force would have been super effective. I still think it would have took us out either way. But hopefully, we get a double miss action. Thermantan's probably going to protect. But well, Darmantan's gonna go first, so he's just gonna come after me. GG to this guy. We are now one on one with this team. We're gonna hop into one more match. Try to get a winning record with this team. Let's go. Ice Crash pops here. Five dust cops. Dude, if that thing wasn't Sash, I we would have out we possibly would have outsped that uh that what's it called? We possibly would have outsped the Darmanitan. Because we actually maybe not, maybe not. But still, I think my dust cops could have taken on one on one with paint splits and all that. We probably could have won that one. Ooh, we going with a little more Pekko squad. I like this guy's team. It's a Gengar and more Pekko. I can see him leading a Snarl. I can see him going Snarl into Togekiss. I'm not even going to lie here. Snarl Togekiss action. I'm going to lead the Fable. I don't even think I'm going to play Trick Room here. Fable Arcanine? Hmm. Fable Arcanine? It's pretty solid. Bring my Haxorus Maximus in the back. Probably have Pex here too. Or we can go... Hmm. I kind of want to get some Snarls off. If he's going to lead that Kiss, Snarl could totally just like do some work on him. We're going to go with that. Let me, let me look at his team one more time. Let me look at his team one more time. He has that more Pekko, which is going to be scary against my uh, my pecs. We know that. He has that Gengar. Probably going to try to put my Pokemon to sleep and all that. That is also scary. Um, if Snarl, dude. Snarl does work. Snarl will do work. Dropping a lot of this special attack Pokemon here. I think more Pekko is physical. I think more Pekko is physical. And I know that Haxorus is physical, but I think the rest, we're chilling. That Grim Snarl is probably just there for light clay setup. So I think we're chilling. Duskops is going to ride the pine. going to be sitting on the bench this time. It's it's fine. It's fine. I, Duskops is alright. I would just rather set up Trick Room with other Pokemon. To be honest with you guys. To be honest with you guys, I, I find other Pokemon a lot better. I like the Jelly Scent to go it, for Trick Rooms. It's pretty good. It's pretty good for Trick Rooms. I like Jelly Scent in there. Hatterene's nice too. Especially with that Ndidi. Ndidi rocks out for a Trick Room team. But we're chilling here. We're chilling here. I really do like this team though. This team is tons of fun. I would just... If I'm running a Trick Room team, I would just go with something else. The Grimstar and the Haxorus gets to me. I can see the Steel coming out here. We have our Babiri Berry. And we have our Arcanine. Um, what is the play here? It, this is, um, this is kind of good. This is going to be tough here. I mean, I see us eating up, not even going to lie, with a Babiri Berry. I can see us eating up with a Babiri Berry. Let me, let me, let me see something real quick. Let me see something real quick. This is your stats. Are you HP defense? Your HP defense. Okay. I see we still throw a Moonblast into you. Because we should be able to eat up a shot. We should be able to eat up a shot. We have the Babiri Berry. We know the Steel Spike's popping out here. And then we should we just go into a Flamethrower? Uh, we can go into Snarl. Snarl could be good. Ah, Willow Wisp. Hmm. Hmm. I think I'm gonna just put a burn over on the Snarl. I think I'm just gonna go throw a burn over on the Snarl. But I can totally see the Dynamax yet. Yeah, here comes the Dynamax. Max Steel Spike's gonna pop out here. Probably gonna throw a Light Screen up. Which is rather smart. Which is rather smart, but I totally see us eating up this Steel Spike. Or is he going to go into the Quake? That's my question. That is my question. Where are you going into the Quake? He's probably rocking both moves. He's probably rocking, rocking Max Quake. Probably the same thing that I'm rocking. Steel Spike, Max Quake, Max Worm Win, and maybe a Protect. Let's see what he rolls into. I'm sure I was going to fake out. Oh, you little biscuit. You little biscuit. Here comes the Quake. That's going after my Arc. That's going after my Arc. Bye, Arc. Nope, Arc eats it. That's fine. That's tough news there. Um, We could swap. Thinking he's gonna go for another Max Quake. Do we swap? Thinking he's going for another Max Quake. I mean, we don't have anything that's gonna dodge it. That's the thing. That is that's that that is the thing. Could go for a Morning Sun, but that thing is outspeeding us all day. I said we do go for a Morning Sun here. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> My Haxorus cannot eat it. But dang, dude, he put the flinch on us. I want to get this Moon Blast off. We have our Babiri Berry, so like we are chilling. We do have our Babiri Berry. I think he's gonna go after the. Uh, not my Arcanine again. So I'm gonna just Morning Sun here. I think I'm gonna just Morning Sun here. Or maybe put the burn on. Now we're just gonna Morning Sun. We're gonna regain some health. Morning Sun regains health, and depending on the weather, it will do more and more. So, like, Light Screen pops here. It's gonna help out, make us do less damage here. But here comes the Quake. Oh, he's going for another Quake. That's fine, that's fine. Okay, so Arcanine will go down here. It's fine. None of them were special attacking. I'm gonna go into. Do I go into my Haxorus and say we outspeed that thing? That's tough. That's tough. Or do I go into my pecs? No. Mm. This is tough. This is tough. I think I might go into my pecs here. I don't know. Let's see. Nope. 
It was just a tad bit of work. <laughs> the light screen's just helping out like crazy. Okay, okay. Mm, 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 mm. I really want my hacks in here. Do I see my hacks outspeeding his hacks? My Dynamax hacks outspeeding his hacks? That could be huge. That could be totally huge. Well, we can just go for a follow me. We can just go for a follow me. In all honesty, we are a high defense Pokemon. We're going to go for a follow me. We are going to take out this hacks here. We're going for it. We are adamant. Mold Breaker's going to pop. They do have the light screen up. He's probably going to try to set up a reflect here. We're just going to go for the follow me. And then we're just going to go into Dynamax Max one win here. And go after his hacks here. This, this could be the play. This could be the play to actually bring us out of this little hole that we... We did not dig ourselves. I mean, we can... We're fine. We're chilling. He just went for the Dynamax early. Kind of put us in a tough spot. Now we just need to fight back. That's usually how it goes. Usually whoever Dynamax first gets the upper edge in the beginning. But most of the time, it's kind of like if you are Dynamax right off the ripple, you got to know that you're just going to dominate the rest of the match. But I feel like we can die. We can Dynamax and kind of like start countering up on him. Because he does have that light screen. Hopefully he does not set up a reflect. If he doesn't set up a reflect, I see the hacks just going down on one hit. So let's see what he does. The follow me is going to pop, which is which will be lovely. Nice little follow me action. See. He's gonna witch on the snarl. That is perfect for us. That's perfect for us, actually. He goes to the Gengar. He goes to the Gengar here. I'm gonna go into the follow me here. Okay, so the Hexer should go down here. Not even gonna lie. And I say we go into another follow me because he's probably gonna go for a hypnosis on my uh on my little boy. On my boy. On my Hexer. So we can possibly go into two follow me's. Hopefully my Hexer just outspeeds and takes him out. That would be the bet the better thing. But we'll see here. We'll see. Follow me is just here just in case. Just in case. But we're going to learn who's fastest. I think the Gengar is going to be the fastest on the field, hands down. But we'll see what happens here. Actually, just use Max Wormwind. It does not affect me, baby. It does not affect my Fable. You'd love to see it. Nice little follow me from here. Max Wormwind takes him out. Let's go. Let's go, baby. Nice play by me. No Max Wormwind's coming after me. It's not coming after me. We're going to drop the thing's attack. The Gengar's attack. But it is special attack. So I know the Hypnosis is coming out. I'm gonna go into another follow me. I'm gonna take, I need that what's called out the way. I need that Gengar out the way. I think Gengar is the big threat now. He took out his big attacker with the Hexers. He's gonna go out into this Grimstar, possibly try to set up screens and all that. He is burned, he is burned. We can totally go into, do we go in, we're going into another follow me here. We can go for a Steel Spike or we can go for a Quake action. Hmm. I mean, Steel Spike won't really do much. Only thing I'm worried about is this Gengar, so we are gonna go into the Quake. He's not, it did not say he's, he's air bleed, right? I told you that thing's the fastest. Oh, no, no, I thought that was the Gengar. We flinched, we could not move. Willow Wisp is gonna pop. Okay, I thought a Hypnosis would run. Willow Wisp is fine. We take those all day. <laughs> Max Quake coming out here. Yeah, oh, yeet. Well, take him out. One tap this fool. I know this thing's a glass cannon. Take him out. Oh, oh. Uh, did we go for a follow me here? Uh, what's the play here? What is the play here? He has a burn up on us. We go for the follow me. Or I can just go straight for the Moon Blast. I can go for the Life Dew. They could be doubling into me. I'm going to play it safe. I need that Gengar out the way. I do need that Gengar out the way, hands down. Uh, what do we do here? We could boost our defense. We could just boost our defense here and take out the Gengar. I'm just going to boost our defense take out the Gengar. Let's go for it. Follow me comes out here. I just got to play it safe. Like I, like, I legit just have to play it safe, and we got this win in the bag. Let's go, Haxers. He's going to go for the Reflect. That's fine. We just want this Gengar out the way. He's our heavy hitter. He's our heavy hitter. We're going to take out both their heavy hitters. I'm not worried about the Snarl. Ooh, a little bit of Sledge Bomb. Oh, that's scary. That is a scary little Sledge Bomb. Okay, but Steel Spike's going to take him out. And then we go for a Life Dew next turn. We could totally just go for a Life Dew here. Now, who's his last Pokemon? He does not have a Dynamax. He does not have a Dynamax. Our Dynamax turns are over. But we have our Toxic Pack in the back, which could be huge. So if it's a physical attacker, we can kind of just claim the game. We can claim that game. I hope it's a physical attacker because we can always go into Baneful Bunkers, all that good stuff. Just rock out from there. Rock out from there. Let's see, let's see. Who is it? Who is it? I'm trying to think. What Pokemon did he have? What Pokemon did he have? Start writing these down. Make things easier. The more Peko. Isn't more Peko physical? But still. Still, it's electric. It's electric! Woogie, woogie, woogie. <laughs> uh, that was a good reference. Good job, Jeans. <laughs> Life dude gonna pop here. Um, not big tantrum. We gotta get some more Peko out of the way. Like, more Peko's gotta go. I'm not worried about the Snarl. Snarl kinda already did his thing. The Stomp Enchantry comes out here. I can see this thing being Sash or Life Orb. There we go. Nice little damage. What's that thing gonna go? Aurora Wheel over on my little boy right here. Oh, Cofable Eats. Such a defense tank. Such a defense tank. Speed's gonna pop here. 
Only thing, oh, Darkest Slayer, go on my hacks. Okay, go on my hacks. That's chilling. That is chilling. Life Dude's gonna pop. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Life Dude pops here. Life Dude does pop. Lovely, lovely. Okay, we gotta double into this more Pekka. Or do I go for another Life Dude? I know he's gonna change. Doesn't he change forms? But he's gonna be dark. So he is gonna be dark here. Hmm. Burns popping all around, all around. Stop and transform's gonna come out again. He's going darkness mode. Darkness mode? Leave me alone. Okay, um. I could totally go for a follow me. I'm gonna just throw a moon blast. I'm gonna just throw a moon blast. Go for an iron tail. Iron tail is now not very effective. Stomp and tantrum is still super effective. Let me go for a claw. A stab claw? Hmm. Hmm. Alright, let's go. Let's go into another stomp and tantrum. I have my pecs. I have my pecs, which I'll just go into a baneful bunker later. It's coming down. It's coming down in the wire. Shiny Hexers for the win. For the win. Come on! Dude, I love more Pekko. <laughs> you guys haven't seen that video. You guys gotta check it out. Dude, more Pekko's a beast. Definitely clutches it up for us. Hopefully this guy's more Pekko does not clutch it up for him. I wonder what he's gonna do. I think he's gonna try to throw in a Roar Wheel. Again, trying to boost his speed. He should go first with that plus one speed. Let's see. Reflect from the Snarl. But it failed. We already have one up. Ice Fang comes out. Oh my god. I wasn't expecting him to rock Ice Fang. I was not expecting him to rock Ice Fang. But we should be able to take out the more Pekko here. We should be able to take out the more Pekko here. Because we have a Moon Blast flying in on it. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. That's going to be the game. That's going to be the game. Get that more Pekko out of the way. We can just go into an Iron Tail. Get a little... Psh, 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 psh. Night, night. Winning record with this team. What a way to get our first video out for Season 3. What a, what a way. What a way to start off. Could have been better. Could have went 3-0. You know, but we took a, we took a hard-fought loss. It was hard-fought. You guys know it. We battled out that one. We battled it out. Um, Moon Blast. Yep. Or should we just go Life Dude? Iron Tail. Yep. We still have our we still have our pecs in the back, so chillin', chillin'. This guy's probably just gonna cancel. Show me that little cancel. Turn off your console. That'd be hilarious. I love when they do that. Just just like in the first battle. Just now, I'm done. Click that. Battle was canceled. GG, baby. Two and one. Winning record. What a way to start off season three. Let's get it, baby. Start off season three pretty strong. Went two and one with this team. That's not bad. That is not bad, especially in the higher ranks. We are in, still in Ultra Ball tier, so we're chilling. We will get Master Ball tier very, very soon. I'm hoping. We definitely should be able to, because I can totally tell that my game is getting better and better. But, guys, that is going to be it for today's video. If you did enjoy the content, don't forget to smash that like button for me. And if you're new here, click that big red subscribe button so you know when my videos go live. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you all in the next one. Peace out, everyone. Thank you.